Hey there everyone, I'm Mr. J, and oh boy, do I have a story to tell you guys. I almost ruined the new Train Troubles update completely by accident. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> but before the video begins, I just want to say this is in no way a hate video or anything like that. This was just a big mess up on both ends that almost led to complete disaster. Anyways, let's get on with the video. So this story begins a little over a month ago in January, when Clover B and IX2 were just messing around in the Train Troubles lobby, shooting children into the sky. You know, average game dev stuff. This was around the time when the game was unplayable, like it is right now, and it was only the lobby that you could join while people waited for the next update. And at that time, I decided to join Clover because I got an invite from him and I had nothing better to do. When I loaded in, there was a ton of other players who also joined, and all of them were just running around crazily while they were getting shot with propulsion guns. There was also just a bunch of random stuff spawned around. It was just complete chaos at that point. And for a while, it went on like this. Just a weird event with everyone expecting to join and get news of the new update, only to be blasted into the atmosphere. Eventually, most people left and the place died down a bit. Cloverbee also left out of nowhere, so it was just IX2 and a couple others. At one point, we started having a conversation, talking about our speculations for the new Train Troubles update and what it was going to be, and surprisingly, that led to IX2 offering to take three of us to go see the new update early! So after some debating and punch-outs with some other players, I eventually landed a spot to go see the new update. And the unbelievable part was that I was allowed to record it. All under some conditions, however. And after that talk, we were off to see the new map. And since the trailer just got released, which you can find in the description, I can actually show you some of those clips. Take a look! An exclusive look at the new lobby for Train Troubles. Woo! Oh, dang, you guys put effort into this. New fresh yeah, the music's new. We're trying to make it more modern oh, instead of the old the cowboy. Oh, right, yeah. That's yeah, there's great. the new Train Troubles logo with the new wagon and all that. Yeah, the patch note only has one patch note, which is a new right. beginning. Nice. The future, we are future. Okay. Um. I love, I love the name. Lol. So we can go to the new game. It's just um the voice lines are still the old ones. Oh. There's new music, new, new train. Everything is new. It's just I don't know. Yeah, the, just the voice lines are the same. Okay. Lol. <laughs> Bro. Oh. Sh this is the wrong, wrong one. Oh, this is <laughs> the wrong one. Wrong this is the old one. Oh. oh, wow. What you see down there, which is currently above the tracks, is the new um, bridge that hits you off. We just oh. forgot to animate it and it's just kind of there. Oh. You, you can see we're now on top of a bridge going over some land sites. Yeah. And... The music is very modern, took me a lot of time. Yeah, Are there new we can go and play a little bit. Like, not right now, but, but we made it, we okay. made the uh, new voice lines four, very cheap, so three, we can add more sound pads. Alright, that's cool. Bro. Bro, how much let's go, let's go baby, let's go, right, I guess let we're go! Playing. Oh wait, what? 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 Oh what man, it broke, it broke, wait, it is it broke? Oh, it broke. Aww. Oh, it broke. <laughs> Whack you off. Hello, babe. Ah! Yeah, we're probably just gonna make the sign say your mama. What I really love, what I really love is that we made the collision accurate so you can like actually oh, stand. Finally. I guess. That was under... one of the problems a lot you of my friends stand had. Here. You can stand right here. <laughs> oh wow. You can stand here. Just jump out. Jump out. Jump off? Yeah. Okay. Jump on. This guy is the first regular player to actually win a game of train troubles on the new map. Congrats, congrats. That's to right! Look like that. The entire map is gone! Hello, Mario. Oh, hello, Bridge. Yeah. 
even though the new update wasn't fully done around then, it was still super cool. And heck, I'm not sure if I'm allowed to show you this, but here's the circuits they use in that game. Oh. Welcome to Train Troubles. <laughs> Holy crap. Hey, so yeah, dude. over here, this is, this is a update. Okay. Yeah. So that's straight ahead is an updated version of the um, voices and like uh, things. Right. Above you is the same thing that just like makes you like if buy then have. Um. Yeah. Yeah, it's crazy. It's a lot. It's crazy. I I don't know how Clover managed this all. Like, how do they accomplish that? That's mind blowing. So, after recording all the cool stuff, I got the OK from IX2 to make a little sneak peek video about the new update, as long as I upload it after he tells me that I can. And as we were saying goodbye, me and the two other guys were actually allowed to take pictures of the new lobby without the train in it and upload it to RecNet, which was very cool. And once we did finally say our goodbyes and get off for the day, I immediately went to go making that sneak peek video. So I spent the rest of the day editing the footage and making it into a video until it was time to turn in for the day. When I woke up the next morning, it was still the weekend, so I got to working on the video once more. And after a long time of working, I finally finished the video and uploaded it to YouTube as private so that I could make it public at a moment's notice. That's when I got a Discord notification. I opened Discord and saw that it was a message from iX2, and I got super excited for a second there, expecting that it said, All right, Clover said you can upload it. Go ahead. But what I got was not that good. So, after IX2 told Clover B about me recording all of the update and making a video, he got kind of extremely pissed, and I was kind of terrified. I immediately responded saying that I wouldn't upload if he didn't want me to, and that I took the video off of YouTube. Then I thought of checking my rec room messages just to be sure nothing worse happened. But when I loaded into rec room, I had a single message left unread. A message from Clover B himself. And all it said was, delete the photo that you took in Train Troubles. Now, I know that doesn't sound bad, but coming from someone like Clover, your mind starts to race and panic at the simple yet timid tone of the message. So I immediately wrote an apology message and privated the photo. So now I couldn't upload the video and I angered Clover. Yippee! And the oddest thing about that is that I never got a response from either of them. Haven't heard a single thing after that. Dang, getting on a popular person's bad side is not fun. So yeah, that's the story of how I almost ruined the new Train Troubles update because I was told it was okay to make a spoiler video for the whole thing. <laughs> Anyways, that's the end of the story. Thank you all for watching. If you liked the video, then consider subscribing. It helps out an absolute ton. And a shout out to Rabid Red for being a server booster on the Discord server. You can check out their channel in the description as well as a link to join the Discord. Oh, and Clover, if you're watching this, I'm sorry about all that. Please don't be mad. See you around in the next video. Bye!